Oh, sorry. I'm, I must have the wrong address. Well, you might as well come in and rest your souls and have some tea. Do you have something there for me, Tommy? Yeah. This place feels familiar to me. Uh, it's a smell from childhood, a deja vu. Now, Tommy, I'm going to whisper a little errand for you. Hear me well, I. You look like someone I... I... The Cubans have fast boats they use to cross the seas with drugs. It is their livelihood. Me nephew been making little flying bombs to take them out. Blow the boats to coffin wood. Thanks for the tea. You know where the limits are. You have to know what's good and what's evil. You need someone to tell you so. Single moms have obese kids, it's a fact. While rich people have a lot of guilt, unnecessarily, in my opinion. I agree. I don't. Daddy, next time he comes home late, smelling of cheap perfume. Okay. It's time to take a break before we hear about any more criminal acts against government employees. You're listening to Pressing Issues. Morality is the subject at hand. Let's explain exactly how free radio without commercial breaks works. We'll be right back. You're listening to VCPR. Finally, a radio station for teachers and librarians. You've been enjoying pressing issues, but as is normal, you can't listen to an hour's worth of programming on this station without us begging for money. It's the Bi-Daily Begathon here on VCPR, where we hold your favorite shows hostage until you pony up some cash. You know what's so great about VCPR? It's like a shining torch of culture. Enlightenment for Vice City. In these times of darkness, when the hordes are so uneducated they can barely understand multisyllabic phrases like clean my shoes better, Marissa, or I'll report you to the IRS, or dialectical materialism. Isn't it pleasant to have a patronizing voice on the radio? That's right, Michelle. With the way things are going under Reagan, at any moment the unwashed Huns from the Midwest could descend upon Vice City and enslave the poets and postal workers and force us to watch network programming. That is frightening thought. But like many things in life, you can throw money at something and feel better about yourself. VCPR is your public radio station, but you have to open your wallets. That's right. If you pledge at the $1,000 level, you'll get tickets for In the Future There Will Be Robots at the Vice City Art Center. People who see that show say it's difficult to put into English. That must mean it's spectacular. Yes, but if you don't give money to VCPR, we could be thrown back to the Stone Age. Liberals will be set on fire in the streets. Give now. Let's return to pressing issues. Over to you, Maurice, in the studio. Useless, talentless asshole. You're correct. He is an asshole. I love those guys. Really professional and living proof that all of the best talent isn't on commercial networks. These people do it for love because they have integrity, just like me. We're back with Pressing Issues. I'm Maurice Chavez, winner of five public radio awards in the Vice City area, including Best Voice. On this show, we take complex issues and boil them down to simple ones so you can understand. On this segment of the show, we are discussing morality. Since the beginning of time, man has asked questions. Why are we here? What time is it? And is there a place around here a guy can get a drink? Early man, as seen in the cave of Blascoz in France, questioned the morality of making the mammoth extinct. I think we all know what happened there. Is it society's job to tell each other how to live? Recently, my city considered passing a public curfew that says nobody can be on the streets after 8.30 p.m. Of course, the bill did it. 